President Trump and his team envision a future in AI development where the US leads the world, powering everything from autonomous vehicles to military AI. But let's talk numbers. A typical AI data center can consume as much electricity as a small city. And when you multiply that by hundreds or even thousands of centers, the demand starts to look, well, pretty intense. Founder of Digiconomist Alex De Vries tells us how these digital trends have accelerated energy consumption. During the previous decade, they were responsible for at least 1% of global electricity consumption, and that percentage is like increasing fast over the past few years uh, due to trends such as uh, digital currency mining uh, mm -hmm. and also recently artificial intelligence, which is also extremely energy hungry as well. So, you know, in the coming years, it's already been... The energy grid is an interconnected distribution network of power lines and substations, delivering current from the source of generation to your house. Modern power generation is made up of multiple different methods and technologies, primarily including coal, gas, nuclear, solar and wind. Each of these offer benefits and downsides, often being implemented for different use cases and locations. For example, solar works better in sunny climates and wind turbines are often placed offshore where there is more uninterrupted wind. Whether it's a few hundred megawatts or multiple gigawatts, these generation systems are only designed to be able to provide a certain amount of power to any given area. When a higher amount of energy is being consumed than expected, it creates a strain on the available resources and can limit supply to end users. Building new plants can be slow, costly and complicated. So the question arises, does the United States or any developed country have the energy infrastructure to support massive expansion? 